Hello, and welcome to the Daily Almanac for May 12th. So, let's get started. First day in history! On this day in history, May 12th, 1816, the Columbian Press, the first iron printing press invented in America, was designed by George E. Clymer in Philadelphia. Also, on this day in 1936, the Dvorak typewriter keyboard was patented in the U.S. August Dvorak and William Dealey studied existing typewriters to determine whether they could arrange the keys in a new way which would speed up typing. They designed a keyboard that placed commonly used letters on one row and that made the stronger fingers of the hands do most of the work. And on this day in 1978, the U.S. Department of Commerce said that hurricanes would no longer be given only female names. You may ask, why are they given names at all? Well, the answer is to help us identify storms and track them as they move across the ocean. There can be more than one hurricane at a time, and without naming them, we could get confused as to which storm we're talking about. World Power! Today on Word Power, we're going to talk about the word vegetable. We all know that vegetables are the parts of plants grown in the ground that we can eat. Carrots, beans, spinach, and cabbage are all examples of vegetables. Can you think of a few? Now, did you know that in order to stay healthy, we all should eat three to five servings of vegetables every day? The word vegetable comes from the Latin word for growing or flourishing, vegetabilis. Well, you know, maybe that's why I feel so great when I eat vegetables at my meal. Today on Extremes, we ask, how old is the oldest fragment of Earth ever found? The answer is between 4.3 and 4.4 billion years old. It's a small crystal of zircon which was found in Australia. This zircon crystal is 100 million years older than any other fragment of Earth ever found. The oldest rock ever found was almost 4 billion years old. It was found in Yellowknife, Northwest Territories in Canada. Scientists believe that the Earth itself is about 4.5 billion years old. Health Tips <laughs> To stay healthy, you need to eat enough grains every day. Children who are eight years old and younger need four to five servings of grains a day. Girls who are nine to 13 years old need five servings a day. Boys who are nine to 13 years old need six servings of grain each day. Now here are some examples of what one serving of grain equals. One serving equals one slice of whole wheat toast, or a half an English muffin, a quarter of a large bagel, one pancake, one small tortilla, one cup of cooked pasta, five whole wheat crackers, a half cup of cooked cereal like oatmeal, one cup of whole grain cold breakfast cereal, or one hamburger bun. I do you know if your state is working hard to use less energy? In New Hampshire, the state government is trying to show its citizens how to conserve energy. Carpooling, buying cars that use less fuel, and using energy-saving light bulbs in their offices are just a few ways that the New Hampshire government is using less energy. If our leaders are not being responsible about energy use, how can they help make sure that we all take care of the planet? I want you to write your state representatives to find out what your state government is doing to use less energy. Well, that's all the time we have left today for Daily Almanac. Thanks for stopping by, and I hope to see you tomorrow. <laughs>